Bizarre case for to have him down as man of the match. Yes, isn't <laughs> yes, it? Yeah, yeah, Dropped yeah. a clanger for man of the match because he was that good it's in the odd. second half. Man, they need keep, keepers need to do that. If you make a mistake, your back four or whoever's in front of you thinking, oh no, here we go. He's having a, he's having a sinker today, but he brought it back yeah. and the confidence was brought back as well. So Wednesday night, Liverpool Tottenham. Wow. Well, I, I, I'm not being facetious. We know how Tottenham are going to play, don't we? Yes. 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 <laughs> and, you, and, you, yes and you can do. and you can pick their eleven. We can pick yes. their eleven. Now, what do Liverpool do? Now, what do Liverpool do? Is Matip going to be fit? Because Liverpool finished that game with Fabinho and mm. Jordan Henderson as centre-halves. Yeah. What do they do about Kane? What do they do about Kane dropping into the centre circle in the way that this time last week discussed Arsenal didn't have an answer to? What do Liverpool do about that? Well, you'll have that's a... the big threat on the counter, isn't it? It won't be one... If it is Jordan Henderson and Fabinho, I don't think either will probably go and track him wherever he goes. I think the conversation will be between the holder midfield player of Liverpool just to stand a little bit deeper and just stop that pocket between midfield players okay. and defenders. So stand 10 yards deeper, yeah. almost? Yeah, so play with a sort of like a little, little sort of V where you have your yeah. holding oh, midfield yes. player deep, yeah. bang in front of your centre-halfs. If it's Catering and Van Aldem or whoever the personnel is, them two can get forward, but yeah. one has to sit in front of Kane. I think what you can't do is you can't leave Henderson or Fabinho one on one-on-one -on -one with a Kane or a Son. So if right. somebody drops in there, Kane drops in there, you can't as a centre-half go in because then the gap between the two full-backs is massive and you're not a centre-half. So you have to work it better. And what Don says is absolutely spot-on. Get the holding one to stay there, keep the two centre-halves together. That's what you this is. This is where you find out, Mark, with managers, and I'm talking Jurgen Klopp here, what his philosoph philosophy is going to be just in this one game. Because we've played with managers who are so respectful and so fearful of the opposition, you end up negating what you're good at. So it might be a case of Jurgen Klopp saying to Andy Robertson, don't go as much. Trent, yeah, don't go as much. Because they've got Bergwijn and they've here. got Son and they've got Kane. They might hurt us yeah, in yeah. behind. But if Liverpool then go, forget that, go forward, yeah. you see Liverpool scoring two and three because yeah, they can't. Well, because Liverpool will have the ball, won't yes. they? Because the way that Tottenham play, Liverpool are going to have plenty of the ball. Well, you've had that before, Dion, haven't you? Yeah, Where many man times. manager goes overboard on the opposition. You start questioning, well, actually, are we respecting Tottenham too much? Should yeah, we exactly. not just play our own game? Yeah. And you know what, as well, because Tottenham have players that are very cute and they'll, we call it cheating, but what they're doing, they're being very cute. Son won't go all the way back. Bergwijn won't go all the way back, but they'll just be on the right side of Don's right shoulder. So if the ball goes over Don's shoulder, I'm in. It's very, very clever, and I think Mr Mourinho will allow them to do that to a and certain And just before degree. we go to the break, Sean Wright-Phillips was with us here on Saturday night, and he obviously played under Jose Mourinho, and he said <coughs> that Mourinho would say to him, we get a point at our big rivals' grounds, then we back us to beat them at home, mm. which they've done already, they've yeah. beat Man City at mm. home. So that's a great point. So, you know, we know what Tottenham's approach is going to be. Liverpool have more of the ball. Have they got the energy, the wherewithal, the players? Well, Jose said a Just couple of weeks ago, and it was actually quite refreshing, where he said every game that he goes into, he tries to win the game. Mm -hmm. I think he's fibbing a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> because ask Pop him this one. Ask yeah. him now yeah. over a cup of tea. Do you want a nil-nil? No cameras. Point. Do you want a nil-nil? <laughs> yes. Yeah. That'll do Thank me. Thank you very much. <laughs> nil-nil, cup of tea with a biscuit. <laughs> yes, that will do. <laughs> right, we'll take a break. Next, we'll be focusing on Arsenal. Things going.